this is Imrad from mgtoots.com and in this video I'm gonna show you what's in new in Artcom 2017. Before I have a little announcement. Right now I'm working on a full Artcom 2017 media course. If you are interested in course, in description you'll find a link to the sign up form. Everybody who will sign up will get 20% off discount when course will available. Okay, let's begin. First and main changes in Artcom 2017 is the design. New Artcom get more stylish dark design. Design of icons also change it. This version and previous version launched under Autodesk company and they made design looks like other Autodesk products. Next feature, actually this is a big minus in Artcom 2017 you can't open files that you saved under Artcom 2015. To open them, you need to first open them in 2015 version, resave and then open it in 2017. Another new feature in Artcom is right mouse click zoom. By default, this option is off. To turn it on, go to edit and open options. Then open to the view drop down tab and check this option here. Apply and close. Now if you hold Ctrl and click right mouse button, then it will zoom in. In upper side, if you will hold Shift and click right mouse button, it will zoom out. I think this option is useless while every mouse has mouse wheel and you can use it to zoom in and zoom out. Next new feature in Artcom 2017, add it to layers in project panel. Now you can create new layer just by clicking on a new plus icon right here. In the previous version, to create a new layer, you should click on layer type and click on the plus button below. Let's switch to another feature. This option is useful when you are drawing with a polyline. Let's choose polyline and draw. Give attention to the cursor. When you cursor vertical or horizontal, cursor changing to show that line correct. Now let's draw a rectangle with it. After drawing two lines, you can see that cursor changes to the third view. It crosses a line to the vertical and horizontal lines and we can easily draw. In a previous version, this option exists, but it allow you align only once to vertical or horizontal lines. Now in Artcom 2017, when you are creating the text, you can choose the font and preview. Let's choose text and on the right panel you can see here font list. After opening, you can see here font name and also font preview. Another small feature is adding selecting vector into active layer. To do that, let's create a new layer and select it to make it active. Then select rectangle and holding control button. Then dragging it to create a copy but before releasing button holding shift button and releasing all buttons. Now if you will turn layer off, you will see that copied object added to new active layer. Now in Artcom 2017, you can export selected object into EPS vector format. Select object that you want export, then go to vector from top main menu. Now select export. From list of file formats, you can see here you have EPS format. Select it and export. Hey guys, that was the part of the new features. In the second part, you will see last of the new features that added in Artcom 2017.